purpose of this video is to talk about Southwest Internet's plans to bring next generation broadband to the rural regions in the Southwest. The audience this video is intended for are existing and future customers, partners interested in working with us, and like-minded people and organisations in other areas who would like to copy our deployment model. Southwest Internet is a community interest company. The mission of the company is to provide good quality and reliable broadband into remote rural communities, specifically in the southwest. The company now provides broadband across three counties, Dorset, Somerset and Devon, and has the largest network of its kind in the UK. In this video, we will talk about what we are doing now and what we plan to do over the next year in 2010. Our central point where we connect all our services back to the internet is Taunton in Somerset, where we have 100 megabits per second fibre optic service. All our services radiate out from this central location, extending as far as Barnstable in North Devon to Bournemouth and Poole in Dorset. If you visit our website www.wdi.co.uk, there is a link to Google Maps that shows our coverage area. All our connections across this entire area are provided using Wi-Fi wireless internet devices. Our network consists of a backbone of high-speed point-to-point links using the 5.8 GHz spectrum and running the 802.11a protocol. These links can be up to 20 miles apart and can carry 30 megabits per second of data quite comfortably. Connecting to this backbone, we have a number of access points providing community and business access using point to multipoint connections. These use the 2.4 GHz spectrum and the 802.11b and G protocols. These are standard Wi-Fi frequencies and protocols that all modern PCs support. The advantage of piping broadband into communities and businesses in this way is that it's low cost and easy to do. At the same time, the technology is getting better and better and cheaper and cheaper. This makes wireless delivery even more viable as a solution as time goes on. There are three separate elements to our proposal. The first element, we will augment and extend our existing wireless network using commercially available fibre circuits. We are planning to install seven separate circuits, all centred on Taunton. Circuit 1 will be a link between Taunton and Barnstable. This will extend our coverage into Torridge and feed back to our existing customers on Exmoor. The second link will be to Minehead. This will improve our coverage along the coastal strip. The third link will be to Weymouth and Portland. This will improve our connectivity along the Jurassic Coast and the Weymouth and Portland sailing area, making us ready for the 2012 Sailing Olympics. The fourth link will be to Bournemouth. This gives us connectivity back into the university network at Bournemouth University and also north towards Blandford and Salisbury. The fifth link will be to Salisbury to provide coverage into the West Wilts, Salisbury Plain and Old Sarum areas. The sixth link will be to Newton Abbott to provide connectivity into the Dartmoor National Park and also West Devon areas. The final link is to Bude, which is on the border between Devon and Cornwall. We plan to pick up a transatlantic fibre optic link at this point, which will improve our, our resilience further and give us connectivity into the Cornwall area. These seven fibre optic links will improve the resilience and reliability of our wireless network, will reduce our requirement to use expensive commercial masts, will allow us to distribute 100 megabits per second connectivity across our entire network, and will mean we can extend our wireless coverage over a much larger range. The second element of our plan is to use new technologies. New wireless technologies are now available for 802.11n, WiMAX and Femtocell. Initially we plan to upgrade our existing wireless backbone with 802.11n equipment. Theoretically this will increase the range of our equipment and its data carrying capacity. We also plan to deploy Femtocell telephony this will allow our customers to use mobile phones in areas where there is no mobile phone coverage. The final element of our plan is to deploy new services. Now we have a network providing service to a large number of businesses, we are well placed to start offering new services to those businesses. The services we are planning include Wi-Fi hotspot across our entire network, VoIP telephony as a service to all our customers, CCTV and security monitoring, plus anything else that looks interesting, time will tell. So what now? 
We are looking for customers to tell us what they want, partners to work with and help us, and emulators who are interested in copying what we are doing in other areas. If you fall into any of these categories, please visit our website at www.wdi.co.uk where you can find project details and sign up to be kept informed.